beginning band members. Today in class with your sub, you're going to be playing on your mouthpieces and you're going to be playing rhythms from the clapping test that you guys got a while ago, okay? So you need to make sure you get your clapping test out. You don't need music stands today because you should be able to easily hold it in one hand and hold your mouthpiece in the other hand while you play your clapping test rhythms, okay? Percussionists, if you need to set it down on your stand next to your practice pad, you should easily be able to do that, okay? So let's say the sub asks you to play number one on your mouthpiece, okay? You are going to do it just like we do in class, buzzing on our mouthpiece, but now we're going to use puffs of air to match the rhythm that's on number one before we clapped it. Number one went like this. One and two, three, four. Today, you're going to be buzzing it on your mouthpiece. So that would sound like this. Okay? Nice and easy. We're just using puffs of air. You can play as high as, as a buzz as you want or as low of a buzz as you want, as long as we're matching the rhythms together. Okay? So maybe the sub asks you to play number 11. And maybe you're on clarinet. Okay? Clarinet players, please remember you have to play nice and quietly. We should not be blowing real hard right now, okay? So just a nice high sound like we've been working on, and we're gonna play number 11 together. Ready, one, two, ready, go. And that's how we would do number 11. Now, if the sub wants to have you do number one, as a whole class, the sub might say, let's do number one four times in a row. That would sound like this. Maybe I'm a percussionist. Okay? We'll be using, make sure percussionists, you're gripping it correctly. First finger and thumb, and the three fingers as a cage. Okay? And we're going to also place our hands facing down. All right? Now, you should be grabbing your stick about one third up. Okay? About a third up from the bottom. That's where we're going to grab our sticks. Make sure it sticks out just a little bit like that, okay? Percussionists, number one, if we're doing it four times in a row, like the sub just asked, this is what it would sound like. One, two, ready, go. And that was four times in a row for number one, okay? We could also maybe... As a sub, they might have you do it as a whole group, the entire class going all at once, or they might say, let's go ahead and have just the high brass play. High brass is trumpets and French horns. And they might play 11 three times in a row. Here we go, 11 three times in a row, high brass. One, two, ready, go. <laughs> And then they might ask the uh, low brass. Low brass would be trombones, baritones, and tubas. And they would play it however many times in a row that the sub asked them to play it. Or the sub might ask the woodwinds to do it. Or the sub might ask the percussionists to do it all by themselves. And hopefully you guys are focused and you're doing a great job today and having a good time. Good luck, everybody.